My friend who is staying with me is being rude to house guests. What do I do? I, 18F, currently live and go to university in Italy originally from the UK. I live in a house not too far from my campus that is owned by my grandparents. It has been in the family for decades. I pay the majority of the bills and my grandparents save on the housekeeping costs also they own the house outright so there is no mortgage to pay either. And hash x 200b. I always tend to let people stay over at my place, there is usually at least one other person here at all times. For the past few months, a friend that I met at the beginning of uni, ADA, 18F, has been staying with me, her parents' house is quite far away from campus and it can be difficult to travel. I really didn't have an issue with it because there are many bedrooms and like I said there's always people here anyway. As we grow closer to the end of our first year and to summer there have been some issues come up. It's my birthday this weekend and a friend that I've known since we were kids, Kian, 20M, has come to visit and is staying with me for about a week. Since he got here ADA has been quite rude to him and keeps telling me that she doesn't see why he can't just stay somewhere else. Kian and I have history. Though we're not and never have been in a relationship it's all a bit complicated and one of the reasons is we both go to uni in different countries, so he's staying in my room with me. Whenever ADA says something like this to Kian I always apologize to him but he's made it clear that it doesn't really bother him. ADA has said things like this to me before about some of our friends who stay over regularly, so it's not just Kian who experiences this, but because she is also friends with him it is to a lesser extent. And hash x 200b. I mentioned to ADA that Kian would be coming back in a few weeks and staying the summer with me at my grandparents' house. ADA started getting very annoyed which I don't really understand because she had previously told me that she would be going back home when term ends. She told me that it is ridiculous that I'm choosing a guy over her. When I later asked if she was still planning on going back home this summer she said yes. And hash x 200b. I've asked her many times about why she says these things about Kian and my, our friends and expressed that it makes me and others uncomfortable but the answer is always vague and even if I try to ask again it is equally as vague. Her most common response is, I just don't feel like they always need to be around, when I would say to her that I would like her to stop it would a little but then go back to normal. And hash x 200b. I don't really know how to handle this situation now. It really helps ADA out that she has a place to stay closer to campus and I obviously want to support her any way I can but even some of my other friends have told me they feel uncomfortable being around ADA at my place now. The lease is up on one of my other friend's apartment in July and I said that she could stay at mine if she hadn't found a new place by then, there's quite a few bedrooms so it's no problem for me at all, but I don't want her to be made uncomfortable by ADA either. And hash x 200b. Update. When Kian and I got back to my place earlier on I had a conversation with ADA and told her that I would like her to move out and gave her a date that is a few days after the end of term. I said that she could move out at any point up to that date and that I would help with moving as best I could but if she stayed longer than that I would likely get the police involved. As Kian was with me at the time, she started berating him but swiftly moved on to commenting about my friends. This was so much worse than anything she has said before this was insulting rather than not wanting them to be around. She said that I was a sheep, who was just doing what my idiotic friends wanted instead of listening to her. I honestly just started laughing at this point and left the room. Kian later told me that he had seen her packing her things but I also got calls and messages from my friends saying that she had completely lied to them about what happened during our conversation, they knew what I was doing and I filled them in once I had done it. This whole situation was never about rent, bills for me. I earn enough money to easily cover my bills and they are not at all expensive, ADA would pay for her own food and the payment for all food, including mine, was basically a 60-40th split with her paying more. But I have already agreed that if my friend whose lease is up in July wants to stay with me there will be rent involved more so that we both feel comfortable than anything else. Kian and I are great and I'm glad I could finally say this to ADA unapologetically after many conversations not only trying to figure out why this was happening but also explaining that it made me and others uncomfortable and I was at a crossroads in terms of our living situation. I'm not sure if any of this is linked to her possibly having a crush, liking me in any way. That thought had not even entered my mind before I started getting comments about it. But either way I don't really care if she does lol. And hash x 200b. Too long did not read. My friend has been staying with me but is increasingly being rude to our friends when they are over and has an issue with my childhood friend. Hook up, idk how else to describe our relationship. Staying here for summer even though she won't be here. You're well within your rights to tell her to leave. 
that's a pretty normal course of action when a guest is being overly rude. Do you think she has a crush on you? Kick them the fuck out. ADA is in love with you. Could be a crush. Could just be someone cagey about having guests in their home. It doesn't matter, because none of it gives her the right to act like this. We can't help how we feel, but we're responsible for how we respond to those feelings. Much less to someone who offered for you to stay at their house. You made the right call to kick her out. ADA listen, I let you stay here because I'm nice. Do you can either stop your shit this instant, and I mean fucking stop it, or you can pack your shit and go. Up to you. Saw the edit. Yay NVMLMFAO out of here tears of joy. She definitely likes you. I can't wait to see what new lies and stories Ava will spin to try and push this in her favor now that you've put your foot down.